Okay, we just completed our walkthrough. It was very, very good. We've got a roof. It's our house. This is going to be our neighborhood. This is on the right side of the house, facing the house. We'll have obviously a faucet here. This is with the internet, obviously our, our box to uh, use all our energy. Here's uh, for gas. We have gas uh, range, gas uh, dryer. This is for our tankless water heater right here. Obviously this is all for the air handler. All this stuff right here and we will have a faucet in the very 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 back as well everything is is, is put into the walls very very well I mean uh, I, I can't see anywhere that a bug can get inside any of this other than those little blue things there but everything looks really really tight all right and this is that's the uh, that's the right side of the house there's all our stuff Coach lamps, downspout for the gutters will be here, and at the other corner of the house there. Okay, the very good. Not, gutters. not in the uh, center. We center. actually, we actually had one. We saw, we saw one right here, and that was a no-no. Yeah, <laughs> right, here's our flooring. We're gonna this drywall right here has uh, been here since like November. And we repaired that and replaced that. Obviously, they're going to increase the uh, height of our garage a bit. Yep. It's well framed on the outside, too. Everything is absolutely level, by the way. I mean, we check, everything's level. All right, so um, obviously, this right here is all our wiring, uh, main wiring for the for the house, obviously power for the house and whatnot. Did he say what this is? Oh, this is our water right here. That's right. Yep. That's our water main. Yep. That rises up here. That's our water main right here. Yep. Okay. And that's our faucet. Very, very good. Tankless. Oh, this is the uh, the piping for the tankless water heater yep. right here. We're gonna have a tankless water here, so we're gonna have a sink put in right here. Yep. This is uh, part of the garage where usually the water tank would go, but we're actually gonna put a sink here refrigerator and uh, things like that in this little spot here for uh for uh for bait and whatnot there's this little green line you'll you'll see these little green lines that is actually for pest control it uh, has these little micro pores on the so if you see the green it has these micro pores throughout the entire house that uh that is released uh, this one gas to uh to kill bugs and and whatnot Here's our uh, attic. Uh, attic has this one very, very small area here. We're actually going to, after we get move in, we're actually going to uh, take this attic uh, and make it larger and uh, then put boards up and go from there. We got a lot of lighting in this garage, a lot of lighting in this garage. That's what we paid for. Yeah. So very, very pleased with that. Heavy duty, everything again is very linear. And we have a, we have a door. All right, and stepping into <laughs> from our garage, which we have a garage yet. Into the house. Yep, and so this right here is the closet. Of course, on the other side is where the refrigerator is, uh, facing uh, backward. And so this is what the uh, the lines will look like for our refrigerator. The blue that you see are outlets, blue and white, all for power. All right, and then in our laundry room here, this is what our laundry room will look like. Again, all large doors, very high uh, doors. This is what our wiring and everything will look like. This is our dryer vent and what it will look like. Okay, washer dryer. This is going to be our internet 
This is our Cat5 wiring. Goes up and then scattered throughout the house. It's all uh, pre-wired throughout. A lot of lighting in the uh, laundry room for us. Again, here's a little wiring for the uh, internet. And runs along the outside and on the top. We just come back to inside the garage itself. We just wanted to be sure. Again, we're going to have a sink put in right here, and then we're we're assuming this is probably, uh, I guess, gas. I think. I mean, it's copper, so we think that that's what this is, but we're not sure. And then uh, again, more water lines. I think that this right here might be a, a low faucet, or it might be for our air handler. I'm not sure. It goes up. And again, it looks like it's for water. That's our hot water? Yeah, I think so. I, I think that's for our hot water. Okay, looking out our front door. This is what our front porch is going to look like. A little tiny little thing, but that's what the roof will look like. The down light, pretty empty space there. Again, uh, they're going to build up all this with more dirt and then, uh, pavers and uh, whatnot. A front door oops <clears throat> coming through the front door Sorry. coming through the front door it's pre-wired here's what our hard hardware is going to look like throughout the house pre-wired for security we've got can light here, can light here, can light here. This, uh, these things coming across right here is actually those little solids that you see across. Those are just reinforcements. Have another reinforcement here uh, through the bedroom. This is what a frame will look like for the door itself. Looking back in the front. Tree wire. And then our front door. We wanted a solid front door so no one can see in. And that's where everything I'll be attached to there. All right, coming across. Again, uh, we'll have an outlet right here along this wall. And then all this is just electrical outlets. This is how they are in the walls themselves. They're about the uh, wall there. And we'll try to measure the height of that get a pretty good idea about uh, that, that. This right here is for uh, the control for our air conditioner, or air handling unit. That's what this is for, this little thing right here. Coming back to the front door again. This is our front bedroom, our bathroom, our, what is it, AC? Air handler. Air handler. Yeah, air handler. And then the computer room. I'm gonna start from the front bedroom. All right, we're in the front bedroom itself. The guest room. Yep, there's a little vapor shield because they're preparing to uh, put in insulation in the drywall. Again, not sure exactly what this little wire is itself. I'll have to follow it along, but I, I, it has to do with electricity, obviously. They'll have an outlet here in the front bedroom behind where the bed mostly goes. Got little frames. Uh, for the drywall here, I mean it is, I mean it is solid as a brick. I mean literally solid. You can oh, see the, solid. yep, so far so good. This right here, uh, the uh, scoreboard insulator is already in for the little corner of the house it looks like. Um, and this will, this will just be an empty space actually because the closet's over there. Yep. So that's just going to be an empty space. Right here, here's the little closet right here. Gives you an idea what that looks like. Again, it looks like there'll be wiring throughout the house here. This is the front bedroom closet here. Now this will be important because we're thinking about hanging a mirror here. There will be a, the door is right here and then it'll swing open. We're thinking about putting a mirror here. So we gotta be careful with the wiring, because there's be an outlet here, 
but it looks like there's wire that runs all the way up here and then there's another wire here it looks like a internet cable there all right so so there is a wire there again and this is the uh, sidewall to the uh, front bedroom obviously bathtub is here and that's what the piping and uh, for the uh, water and everything for the uh, bathtub shower it's there and we'll start there next all right this is uh, the the uh, front bedroom actually so this is what our before we put the drywall in this is what it looks like Oh, bathroom. What I call it? What I say it was bedroom. bedroom. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Thank you. You're right. And then obviously there will be uh, the most important part of the house: toilet. <laughs> yes. That's the most important thing. You know, utilize that sink there. And then there looks like there's a yellow wire for the uh, for the outlets, obviously back out into the hallway I would we'll call it a mini hallway yeah. air handler here so for the air handler there will be our faucets within the wall itself will be here that's what that looks like there solid really good looking wood yes all right in the uh, in the bedroom the second bedroom, I guess, we're going to use it as a study. There's really not a lot of wires or, uh, through here. Obviously, there's an outlet right here. Switches here. Big, big huge closet. And uh, this, is a, uh, this is a very big closet. Mm -hmm. And now we know exactly where the, uh, the pipe is uh, for the uh, water for the bath bathroom, toilet. There's nothing, nothing in this wall right here. Nothing along that wall. And it looks like nothing along this wall. No, no wires or anything like that. Yeah. Right. So the this is the rest of the study. So it looks like we have a what looks like a light here. I'm not sure what that is. Smoke detector. Is it a smoke detector? Very good. Yeah. I didn't realize that. Very, very good. Smoke detector there. Thank you. Mm -hmm. um, and then your wiring will be here along, right along this, uh, this window here. We, are, we have asked them to do reinforcements along the top there for our curtains on the top. And again, all these blue lines that you see is actually for um, for pest control. The blue is for pest control. The green. This here. They, the, uh, the green yes. and the blue together. They, they attach together. Again, everything's pre-wired for, uh, uh, for the alarm system. That it comes uh, with the house itself. Along this wall right here, along the bottom, you have an outlet here, outlet on the other side, and you can see it coming straight across. Internet here, you see the internet outlet that will be here. Again, coming across right here, and then there's another internet outlet uh, over here along this wall. And we're gonna try to get some reinforcements on this wall facing the other way if we can because the Marlin's going to go in between these two walls itself. On the other side. On the other side. All right, coming down our hallway, this is, I think we already, we already did this little video and all, uh, but I don't know what this little rebar thing is. It uh, goes all the way up, but it's just kind of sitting here, so I'm not sure what that is. It's just kind of sitting here. I'm not sure if they just put it in there, but hey, if it's going uh, to be part of the house, it's going to be part of the house. You never know. But in, uh, again, this is the first closet. I think I already did. Again, this is where our refrigerator will be. I'll take another uh, video of it from the opposite side. Uh, from the first closet, uh, as one enters the house. Coat closet. Coat closet. And then uh, again, this, I think we already did video again. But uh, walking into the laundry room, this is, what, this is what this looks like behind the walls. And of course, it'll look completely different when we actually have walls up, but at least we know what's behind the walls. 
of some we have a video record of what's behind the walls, and we have lots and lots of light in here. Yeah. Looks like our looks like our water is going to come across and be in our pantry, and that's our internet here. All right. Okay, entering the living area, dining area. So it looks like they got wires going up there. I'm not sure what that gray box is. Router. Did yeah, probably. Oh, yeah, the router that'll be up there, ready to go. And uh, I'm not sure if we even bought one. I think that's one we can attach to. Mm -hmm. So it's directly above us. I'm going to do this again. Yeah, our router will probably go right there. Either that or uh, the extender, one of the two. Yeah. Right, and all these things have these little things to protect it within it, Keep which is good. Straight. Yep. Line so entering, this is our uh, where our, our uh, refrigerator will go. That's what this looks like here. There's a plug for it right there. Lines themselves. Looks like our, our internet cable is going to be tucked away inside that wall right there, right next to the refrigerator. It's going to be solid, obviously. Cabinets, countertops. Yep, significant wiring here where the counter and is going to be in the cabinets. All right, and this is just going to be a solid wall here. This is a pantry. Big old tall pantry, big pantry. You know, and it looks like uh, other than uh, other than one wire coming across and the cable box on the other side from the laundry room, this is just going to be a, just a oh, simple goodness. simple room, simple room pantry for the pantry itself. Even though it's pretty dug on big. It's one of the biggest pantries for the smallest house. Yeah. Okay. Exiting the hallway into the kitchen itself. This is the good thing right here. Now, we, it looks like we're going to have an outlet right here on the island, which I hope that they, they have. That's one, and that's two. Yep. Like in the model. Yep. And then uh, this is what the inner workings of this is what's going to look like. Looks like we have an outlet here as well. Yep. Looks like we're going to have three outlets good. that's uh, wired up. I guess it's through the, through the floor, obviously, for the sink. And then we've got an outlet here for the wine cooler. Yep. Right there, our counter, that big old heavy counter, is going to be sitting just on this, which is interesting. They're going to have underneath. They're going to have reinforcements underneath? Yeah, like diagonal. I didn't realize. I pretty much think so. Or at least small ones. It has to be. Uh, otherwise, the no. uh, countertop will be sitting on this. That's pretty solid, though. Oh, yeah. That's pretty solid. So this is what uh, dishwasher. Yeah, disposal. Mm -hmm. So that's what that'll be, and then our refrigerator will be there again. Mm -hmm. And then there's a duct up underneath here, and then there's going to be lots of lighting. Lots of lighting in here. That's what our roof above the uh, the island will be. And we chose two instead of three. I thought we had three. Is that not a third? No, it's not. I thought we had three, but we'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. We'll, see, we'll have to see. And then uh, I'm just facing now uh, the main cabinetry for the, uh, for the house. This right here is where our uh, main counter will be, stove range. It's going to be gas, as you can see. This is for water for the bathroom, more electrical, more duct work up there. This is above the, uh, this is where our counter is, where our cabinets are going to be. This is going to be a bare wall, but these things are very well reinforced. If I can get more reinforcement like this, in the wall behind me, that would be wonderful. All 
All right, looking outside. Plenty of lighting out here for us. Four can lights and an outlet for a fan right there. Coming inside uh, to the comfort room. I'm gonna try to get reinforcements all along that top of that wall here for our drapes. A little wire here, it's below the wall. Looks like they put a little bit of reinforcement here to protect it along the wall itself. And then along this wall, master bedroom, uh, there's really not a whole lot. We can we can mount whatever we want here through the wall itself. Looks like there's a there's a, a down light right there. Interesting. I didn't realize that there was one. Master bedroom is turning around. Here's what our ceiling looks like. We are currently in the in the dining room. We we'll call it a sitting room. Behind the walls looks like this. This is the main living room. Looks like we have an outlet here. Mm -hmm. Main windows. Well, we got again line for electricity for TV and whatnot I know it's kind of dark and we're going to try to get some reinforcements along this wall here if we can and then uh, internet is here a white is the internet we can see it coming up we'll do some measurements a little bit later on looks like it's in the center of the wall it looks like the little plate kind of protects it through the wood itself These things kind of move anyway. Looks like we'll have an outlet along this wall here. Internet connection for the uh, computer room will be there. Here's our drywall. This is what this looks like. Gives you the name for the gypsum board. That's basically about it. Looks like we got an air conditioned duct here. We have a can light here. There's four of them that we purchased, plus the uh, ceiling fan. Looks like the ceiling fan, which is going to be a big one. We got extra reinforcements there, it looks like. Mm -hmm. No ducts or anything like that and, uh, otherwise. Windows look pretty doggone good, put in pretty well. At least we're hoping it will be. Screws are a little bit sideways, but maybe they don't have to put in, put in all the way just yet. Uh, really, the only question that we had is, uh, I guess, is this up here. We thought we had, had we had three in a row for down lights, and maybe we do, and maybe we do. We just uh, we don't don't know. But it looks like there's a down light here, down light here, down light here. It'd be a little bit unusual to not have three in a row. I thought that's what we got, but we're going to find out soon enough. Either way, there's a down light there, down light there, down light over there, down light here. We got a lot of lighting though. Yeah. Those Just, are three that does those. There's a lot of lighting here though. Here's the main duct right here before the uh, the bedroom itself. All right. Looks like outside we will have a, an outlet there. Mm -hmm. Obviously coming into outside the sliding door, there we're uh, already ready for the uh, alarm system to be put in. Again, we go outside here, we get a tall door for entry to the bedroom. Again, just very, very simple in the bedroom itself. There will be a, a there will be an outlet here. A little reinforcement along this wall looks like a little bit. It's kind of right in the middle. Our bathroom will be here. Nothing along this wall at all. This is one of our vents is put in here. 
and inside here is our Cat5 cable plus lighting. This right here is our Cat5 cable here. For our internet, it'll be beneath the bed, but uh, that'll be good for us. We'll put a router out there. And it looks like we got water right here, and that's our faucet will be right there. That's here. Self runs across to the very front, and that's how our water lines are going right here. For the outside faucet, hard to get over here. Long boards. So inside the bedroom, we'll have these blue cables here. That's about it. I mean, try to reinforce up top. This is going to be our view. Right in Florida home. And this right here is where the faucet's going to be, actually. This is the outside faucet. It's going to go right here. Pretty solidly put in there, though. In the corner here. Our roof. That's where our ceiling fan will go. Again, it looks like there's extra reinforcements for that ceiling fan. It's very, very good. This also has reinforcements for the ceiling fan also. That's okay. All right, so sink. It's going to be two sinks yep. here. This is what this looks like here behind the wall. Pretty well reinforced. Very well reinforced. I guess that's uh, the lighting uh, for the uh, vanity up, up, up there, also reinforced. Looks like they're reinforcing this right here for the uh, the, the toilet area at the very, very end of the, the counter, actually. And then, uh, then the poopatorium, which is to be good. <laughs> and then the closet. This is a massive closet that we'll have. Laundry room is here. A lot of space in between and there's not a lot in the closet itself it's pretty empty we do have a vent it looks like uh, for air conditioning we got plenty of light we have two can lights here most of our water system is right above this in this corner of the closet it looks like yeah. again this right here is where the hot water heater would have gone <laughs> Uh, so, uh, so the wall itself is fairly thin uh, between the exit, the end of the garage, uh, the external of the garage, and the uh, wall of the house. Pretty thin. And again, this is where all the water goes. It's the main water vein. Getting power to the outside for the air handler itself. And, but this closet is just immense. You can see how it goes all the way back. This is for the tub itself. This is what this, this stuff looks like. Shower. For the shower. Yeah, it looks like we got a can light right there too. Smoke alarm. There's a smoke alarm, not a light? Okay. Yep. Yeah, it looks like this wall is reinforced because there's a door connected to it. This is, that's reinforced there. Mm -hmm. We'll have, I guess, hopefully that'll be reinforced, I'm not sure, but we're going to have towel rack put in here. This is also a, a place to put your towels, it's reinforced, which is nice. It's reinforced whenever there's a door, a heavy door, whatever. We do have a wood reinforcement and it's pretty doggone solid. Hopefully we'll get some reinforcement up at the top here as well. That's what we're hoping for. Again, that is for our curtains. But uh, all, these, uh, all these openings are really, really tall, very, very big. And I think that's gonna open up a lot of space in this house. Mm -hmm. So this is 
what this will look like here. And uh, this that little uh, black thing here, I think we're hoping it will be a, a down light, but we'll see. It could be a smoke detector too. Yeah, yeah, it could be. Yeah. We'll, uh, we'll check the model on the way out the door. Yeah. <laughs> okay. All right, our house. Yay, our forever home. All right.